Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is Mirgloff Builds, and in today's video we're going to make another house, although we're not necessarily going to build it as much as we're going to carve it out of this uh, hill right here. But uh, before we begin with that, I wanted to quickly show a, uh, a renovation I've done on the Fetching Fletcher. Uh, Goodsman's Ghost pointed out that uh, it was, you know, you couldn't see very well from there, and I knew that. I was just, I thought it was good enough, but I decided, why not up renovate it a little bit, make it look a bit nicer. And instead of just bringing it closer, I put it up, uh, raised it up a little bit on uh, fences there. And while I was up there, I went ahead and make it look more even like an arrow. With some wool for feathers and wood for the shaft and cobblestone for the head. And we're now going to begin construction here. Or ex excavation. One of the one of the other. Uh, enjoy the pretty music.
一緒にあなたここに残るのかしらどんな横にいますあなたと一緒にのかしら
Okay, and we're done with uh, Twin Street 2A. And uh, it took longer than I thought it would. But uh, as you can see, I made, I went ahead and got uh, some bookshelves and I made those as a sort of a reading chair and this in general is just a couch. So this is sort of a living room. This is sort of like a dining room, kitchen. And then the second floor here is the uh, living quarters. Food in those chests. And also I made the uh, first painting of this entire series and put it right here because this room needed something and I'm not really sure what this ar area could use. I could maybe turn it into some kind of office thing, I have no idea. And... Also, there's this sort of uh, white wool carpet thing going on here. I think it looks okay. It uh, kind of gets a little bit weird and awkward right here, but that's alright. These furnaces are obviously, you know, an oven. And that is this house. And uh, I, somewhere in the middle of this video, I pressed F8 for the cinematic smooth camera mode to see if uh see how that would look i don't well i don't know how it looks yet because but i will later when i'm editing this whether or not that's easier on the eyes while time lapse mining because my concern is that uh me time lapsing myself mining is going to be hard on the eyes and that's something i want to see but i turned it off fairly quickly because i'll go ahead and turn it back on real quick it's really hard for me to control the uh, reticule, so I can't really mine effectively doing that. <laughs> Whoops, I actually I was going to turn off the smooth camera F8, but I accidentally pressed F9. Alright. And I don't have much more to say other than to mention my own two cents on the whole thing about uh, 1.2 that's going to be coming out. Apparently zombies can break down wooden doors, which is a real pain in the butt for this series, because it basically means I would have to have all of the doors be made of iron or play on a difficulty... That is, well, I play on normal, so. Apparently, uh, zombies will be able to break down wooden doors, as I'm sure most people who pay attention to this stuff would already know by now. But apparently only on hard mode, hard difficulty, so. I think that's something that should be maybe hardcore mode only, but I guess I won't be affected since I'm on normal mode. But even so, they should... If they're going to do that, they should let us be able to make uh, stone doors. So we used, I used iron too much for everything else. Not so far in this series, but normally when I'm doing other stuff, iron armor. And Once I get to... Once I begin working on a transportation system, I'm going to be starved for iron. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video, and thank you for watching. Thank you.